I'm a little drunk right now, so this none of this might make any sense. Um, I just wanted to talk about some things for a vlog, and all these pauses are gonna be edited out. Do you hear my voice right now? Little, it sounds like I'm a it sounds like I'm a man. It sounds like I'm a man right now. <gasps> Okay, here's what I want to talk about. Here's how we we're gonna we're gonna talk about how to keep in touch with friends long distance wise. You could probably apply this to relationships, but I don't have one at the moment. Long distance or short distance, so I really can't speak to that much. But um, I just moved to Austin, Texas from New Jersey, and that's quite a long ways. It took two and a half days to drive here, and I haven't ever driven two and a half days anywhere so this is the farthest I've ever been from home um, states wise so um, I try to stay in touch with my friends quite frequently or actually put effort into doing that one use technology technology is awesome don't you think it's so great like y you can Facebook message them and text them and Skype them and FaceTime them and like Google hang out with all of them and I don't know, there's so many ways you can just talk to each other without actually talking to each other. It's amazing. Do it. Today my friends were going out in New York City and I FaceTimed them. It was like I was pre-gaming with them in their hotel. Like, I wasn't, but it, basically, I mean, I drank wine by myself while they drank shots with each other and um, it just sounds so sad. Um, uh, two, you have to, you have to like, actively put in the effort you know sometimes you just don't want to keep in touch with people because it's not worth it but if you put in the time you're like okay let's schedule a time to catch up every week make it a point to text each other when something big happens that's really important to know that you guys are on that same page like you're a person that I want to keep around for a while so if you could just let me know what's going on with your life that would be awesome thanks Three, call each other on the phone. I know that's like so antiquated or whatever, but like phone conversations are awesome. Aside from maybe Skyping them the most personal you could probably get, text messaging just, just doesn't cut it sometimes and you just want to hear some people's stories and it just doesn't get communicated the way it's supposed to over text or email or anything like that. Four, you guys should start a project together. It's kind of like going to war, but less dramatic. Kind of like going to war in that like, you know, everyone's unified in one cause and everyone's like working towards one purpose and that kind of unifies everyone in that way. Uh, three, four, seven, I don't know. Yeah, I'm so drunk, bye. And as I arrived, I thought I saw you leaving. Carrying your shoes Decided that once again I was just dreaming Bumping into you Now it's three in the morning And I'm trying to change your mind Left you multiple missed calls To my message you reply Why do you only call me when you're high? Hi Why do you only call me when you're high? 